Hey guys, it's Nick from Retro Games HQ, and today I'm playing another episode of Monster Crown, which is an early access. Now, if you've watched, if you've not watched past two episodes, I recommend you go do that. And if you have, then make sure you subscribe and go to if you want to buy a game, Humble Bundle at nixonr.com forward slash Humble Bundle. You can get a game, help charity, and support this channel all at the same time. So you can find the links in the description below and more about Humble Bundle there as well. So what I've done is I went a little bit ahead and this gangster was like, I can't swim. So go ahead and just uh, defeat this and I'll give you what you want. I don't know what he thinks I want. But anyways, here's Walrus. Um, that's his name, Walrus. I don't know if I can tame him. Oh, sorry. Uh, I'm not sure. I'm not seeing any... Um, in, ooh, any indication of, like, oh my god, being able to catch him. Oh, Slime Slap was a lot better. I know Ambigu is going to faint. I'm going to do Slime Slap again because that is such a powerful move. Oh my god. Yep, so I know he's going to do that. That's fine, Laz. Okay, defended itself. It's fine, Spore Shot. Yep, but didn't kill him yet. But the Spore Shot will hurt him greatly. And when he gets so low, I will try once again to... Oh, nope. To capture him. Uh-huh. Yep, hurt. I'm going to tab defend myself. Because you can't defend yourself. Mm -hmm. Just by pressing tab, it, I think it increases your uh, defense. Okay, that's five. Okay, it's number five. So three more times, I say. Mm-mm-mm. Oh, no, it's not going to be more. Let's see how much he hurts me. Okay. So I'm going to take a chance. He accepted. Walrus accepted. Awesome. So this was like a mini boss. Anyways, I got Walrus. This is awesome. Thanks, kid. You're a real peach. I doubt the boss is going to care much for this thing. It only contains a map and some unintelligible scribbles about monsters. Nothing about garbage. Uh, nothing but garbage, but you're garbage now, bub. Now I've got a split. Got the notebook. Awesome. So. What just happened? Harvest skin? What? Oh man, that's pretty freaking cool. Oh, I'm going to have to get him. Just because that is neat. Good. Resist. He resisted as well, though. That's fine. He's also poisoned now. So maybe I'll get packed with him. I don't know if we call him. I don't know what you technically would call this, considering he's, um, hmm. Huh, what would you call it? Is it still monster? I guess it's still monster taming, but it's different than what we would think. You know, it's like you're making a pact with them. Okay, so 18, and then gets hurt by infection. Okay. So I'm going to do one more 18, 15, 12. Okay. Mm -hmm. So that means I can do another one. He's only hit me for one. This is insane. Seven. Okay. Okay, come on. Uh, I gotta speed this text up. I gotta see if there's a speed up text option. Anyways, a normal pack. Consider it done. Yes, accepted. 
All right, well, I was going for a pumpkin, and instead I got harvest skin. I didn't know that was a thing. I didn't want that. All right, secret. Come out. Vile tail. Mmm. Okay. Dang it. Um. Hopefully I can get this hit off. Nope. Okay. That's fine. I'll just be put back to beginning. Uh. I kind of feel bad for having this 167. But I do... I don't know what to do now. What the heck? <laughs> oh my god. What the heck? Why is it sacred? Why has it got one synergy? Up. Oh. There we go. Oh my god. Okay. Switch. Now I have no problem going to Walrus. This is kind of weird. I'm going to be honest. I can't lie. I think this is a brute. So, power zero. Refreshing gulp that replenishes 20% HP. A harsh slap. And user's drums up 10% defensive boost on its blubber. Okay. Whether they faint or not, they apparently get some XP. I don't understand. Okay. One. Feed, 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 feed. Okay, is he better? Up, oh, move. Um, is he better? Oh, yeah. He is healed some. Odd. Anyways, notebook. Will beats brute. Oh, you even got that bottom thing. So, Will beats Brute, Brute beats Malicious, Malicious beats Unstable, Unstable beats Relentless, and Relentless beats Will. So, I'm going to take a picture of this. Okay. So, Will beats Brute. 1.5 times, not 2 times, but Will beats Brute, Brute, so that's Malicious. That one's Unstable, that one's Relentless. But then it goes the opposite way. So it's Brute does 0.5 to Will. So it's actually Will half damage Relentless. Relentless half damage Unstable. Unstable half damage Malicious. Malicious half damage Brute and Brute half damage Will. Okay. Um, quest log. Deliver. Mm -hmm. Working. Permagon. Primagon are useful as beasts of burden. They often are seen pulling carts all over Crown Island. Unfortunately, their stubborn nature makes keeping a breeding population almost impossible. Most would-be Primagon owners to have no choice but to, let, uh, to pay a local tamer to collect on their behalf. Okay. So that's Will. This is unstable. Constantly morphing from form to form, it seems comfortable in a cephalopod-like shape. So, cephalopod. Cephalopod. I don't know. I'm having issue with that. It constantly seeks metallic material to consume and incorporate into itself. That's creepy. Tedon. Tedon attack with their large jaws, snapping any on a uh, snapping shot on foes. Any attempts to shake uh, Tidon off will fail. Their jaws lock and their large nostrils allow them to breathe without ever having to let go. When it groups, they often frenzy. What the? River Boss. Due to recent evolution of the intimidating Darwal, this monster no longer finds itself at the top of the food chain. Desperate to find an environment to throw their weight around and declare themselves king, they have began to swim up rivers. The dark fungus uses a seemingly otherworldly power to reanimate the corpse and roam the land. 
It no longer grazes on shrubs or consumes water. In fact, it requires longer, it no longer requires, seems, longer seems to require even oxygen as it can freely enter the toxic swamps uh, that Bornox inhabits. All right. Oh, did I go all the way down on that? No, I didn't. What's this? Huh? Oh, this is the map. Apparently, I can't do anything with it yet. That's fine. E. E. Alright, let's go. It's another one. Harvest skin. All right, and switch to ambiguous. It's fine. Just what is the top for unstable against malicious? No. Okay, so it resists. Decrease ten percent though. Even though I resisted, I died. Dang it. So, even though Walrus seems all good and crap right now, apparently there's an evolution that tops it. So, it's not like the end of the world kind of thing. A bit crazy that I can capture it this early on. Um, what the heck? Okay. Up. Oh, there's another little thing. Oh, I get to go talk to it. Oh, what the heck? Please don't be another one. I just need to feed something. Thank you. Yep, eat it, buddy. Oh, what's this? Oh, I found a normal pack. Awesome. Please be just a fruit. Thank you. Awesome. Feed him. Feed him. Feed him. Feed him. What's this? It's the harmless monster, Oppo. Stay safe, Oppo. Can't catch him? Okay. Anything? Nope. Anything? All right, backtracking, backtracking, backtracking. Go down. Yep. Yep. Nope. Can't go that way. What the heck's that? Oh. Where's my dude? Oh, there's more oppo. Owl leaf. All right. Let's face the uh, these lads. Harvest skin. E. No, let's go to this. Mm hmm. Yep. Infection. Blah 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 blah. Smother. Yep. There we go. Okay. Harvest skin grew to level six. Awesome. Alright, battle him again. Smother. Oh, what? It didn't instantly kill him. Hmm. Hurt by infection. Okay. So that when he attacked, does the infection happen? Level nine. Oh, if you hear something, that's my that's the rain at my house. Welcome to Milltown, home of Dew Cave. <laughs> Very peaceful. Oh. Hmm. 
One through just explore. Whoa there, boy. Oh, we're doing some pretty sensitive work here. This equipment's fragile. Stay back in town now. I can't afford to lose time dealing with those no uh, nosy folks like you. Boss, but but boss, this place is absolutely loaded. We've got at least twenty thousand G worth of mineral zephyr on the surface alone. Daniel, keep it down. We're trying to keep a good deal on this contract. Don't go shouting something like that. Sorry, boss. Listen, kid. Can you keep your mouth shut? Last thing we need is for Jasper is for Jasper to know about this. Everyone's out for themselves in this business. We'll be working for less than minimum wage if Jasper finds out how valuable this place really is. Here. Take 100 G and you can have grab whatever's loose on the cave floor. Just stay quiet and get back to town until we're done. What's this? Oh. Be like, little devil. Little devil go. That's cute. Blah. All right. I was about to say, did that just do nothing? Okay. Mm -hmm, mm hmm. Blam. Mm hmm. Yep. Normal pack. Accepted. Yay. I wonder where I can. I now have like. Too unstable, too. Um, so too unstable, a brute, too mischievous, mischievous. Um, I don't think it's a good deal. What's this one say? Some monsters plain outrank others in inherent power. You'd think general power at level would be a good indication of a monster's power, but a powerful monster at level. 10 will beat a level 10 road ask easily. <gasps> What's this little thing? Nautilus. Salty spout. Cute little thing. Yes, ambiguity. You can come out. Stop begging. Smother. Yeah, come out. Blah. Dang it. It's gonna kill it, ain't it? I didn't want that. I just want to go and cheat a dang. Oh boy, I just keep screwing up. I swear it's my first year on the job. Okay. <laughs> Let's keep exploring, guys. There's something over here. Nope. Man, I really like this. Keep it to the bottom. Ooh. Oh. 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 Hello there, young boy. At times over the past 20 years, I would take a moment to look out at the sea. I could always see them watching. Those monsters just beyond the shore. The F you. Oh my god. No hope lies beyond the shore. That's what everyone says. It's only now, at the end of my life, that I ask myself Is it really the F you that are watching? Huh? Oh, are they being used? Oh, what a selfish man I must be. To have spent my life carefree and now burden you with the troubling questions like when you ha like these when you are so young. Enjoy your life, boy. It goes by so much quicker than you even imagine. Hmm. Interesting. Nope, can't get through there. Nope. Oh, 
daggum. Daggum. Be lot. Maybe bilat. Like bilaterals. Harvest skin. Switch. To walrus. Okay. Hold on a moment. Does this bylaw have 103? <coughs> Are you kidding me? <coughs> Excuse me. Ooh, down to three. Oh my god. Mm -mm -mm. Almost. It's your harvest scan. Hmm. Ah well. Ah well. Yeah, I'm gonna have to even out my team more. Also, I gotta decide if I'm gonna focus on uh, trying to get all I can as well, like um, you know, whatever these monsters' names are. Hey, Bylot grew to level 8. Bylot learned Skull Slam. Mm -hmm. Milltown. I don't really trust that guy, Jasper. He's got a silver tongue and seems to get a thrill from taking advantage of others. Sorry, I'm not much in the mood for talking today. But uh, please enjoy our local wares and uh, fabulous restaurants. It's a bunch of complicated looking books. I make packs seem simple in comparison. Okay, buddy. What's this? Looks like a delivery. The postman must have delivered it by stork lift. Oh. <laughs> um. No. Oh, purple little flag. Everyone's so excited, and I'm not sure why. The only one that should be excited here is me. They think that prospectors just came out of nowhere. I'm going to own this town. While we all pay taxes to the kingdoms and the kings regularly to visit to offer visit to offer advice, uh, and the kings regularly visit to offer advice, towns are generally pretty self-run without much interference. With a great mayor, it's wonderful, but with one that can't stand up for himself, well, please be smart, Neil. My daughter spends far too much time with her boyfriend. I'm starting to think they're codependent. I I just wish mom would understand what difference it it makes. It make who his father is. It doesn't make who his father is. I know he's good inside. Okay. I didn't want to hear. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I don't know what just happened there. Didn't want to hear, didn't want to know, didn't care. This is the... Welcome to Milltown, home of Duke Cave. Oh, Tamer. Young Tamer. Come over here. Yes, buddy. Ho, oh, I'm this town's healer. You look like a Tamer, but you've never heard of us. Uh, no worries, though, kid. This here's my Curie. It's a special type of monster with some pretty amazing magical powers. The kings employ us to offer healing service and gives each of us a curry from a private breeder. While they're unsuited for combat, they can unleash a wave of powerful healing over your monsters. Unfortunately, it uh, leaves her out cold for quite a while. I'd be happy to heal your monsters, as, uh, as would my comrades, but to assure only tamers that truly need to take advantage of curry's abilities use them, it's a cost. If that's okay with you, just give me the word and I'll get your team healed straight away. Fifteen dollars, yes. That's completely reasonable. And what's this with this socials, healthcare bullcrap? This is what I'm talking about right here. Makes sense because there's actual costs. Hi, Retro Games. Do you recognize me? You probably don't. Your mom and I went to school together as kids. Yeah, 
Why would I recognize you then? Okay, let's go into this little house. Are you one of the prospectors? No. You're too young. This town is in the middle of starting up a mining operation. Pretty exciting. So you tell me that we have kings and stuff, but at 14, I'm too young to work? How? First off, 14 is old enough to work. You know. Mines, if you're in a poor country, absolutely. You're in the kingdom, it seems almost like medieval-ish. Daggum right, yeah, it's old enough. 14 is like the age people went out on their own. Or, generally though, that was when you got married or some crap. Which is kind of sad to marry that young, but that was a necessity uh, back then because you didn't live almost, you know. If you live past your 30s, you're really freaking good. But luckily that's not the case anymore. Hey, I recognize you. You're Isaac's son. I haven't seen you in a couple of years. Hope everything's great at the farm. Okay. Rough Nick. The prospectors are nearly done? That's great. Jasper? What do you mean, Jasper? Why would they be dealing with... Oh, crap. Can you come with me? Oh, are we about to confront this rich man? Listen, listen. Hey, listen, listen. It's all legal in black and white. You can't argue with the paperwork. You own... Only store in town. You nickel and dime us and charge us a ridiculous amount of money. Okay. I'm... I hate this kind of crap. Like, oh, well, no. What he would be doing is he would be doing... Um, he'd, he'd charge you whatever price he thinks. You could profit the most. And you all just say that it is ridiculous. When, in actuality, you all keep buying from him. And if he thought that he could offer lower prices and it would be making more profit, then he would. But you all obviously, with demand and supply, you demanded enough and there's not enough supply of this stuff. It ain't, come on. He can barely afford food for our kids. You want to own the mine too? Well, yeah, it's called private property. He, If he bought it, he bought it. If he mines it, he mines it. If no one mined it before, he mined it. Hey, it's his. What's wrong with it? He's making the town, well, it's like... Voluntary beneficial trades. Come on. What? Jasper's going to own the mine? Of course I'm going to own the mine, you got darn peasants. What? You're all angry because you didn't think of it first? Because you lost a good deal when I was the one fast and smart enough to get in on it before you? I mean, he's right. Otherwise, that mine just be a freaking mine. He keeps getting good, valuable resources that will go to use. And you call him greedy? Well, guess what those things will go to use? To satisfy customers, because that's how you make money. That's just the law of nature, you cards. Forward thinkers, entrepreneurs, go-getters. It's people like me who reap the rewards. It also is the people like him that bear the, uh, the burden of costs and possible losses. Well, potential and realized losses. The mayor was going to sign it. The deed was supposed to be ours. The king himself agreed. We should all own it. We should all reap the rewards of our work. It's called a working wage. Uh, we'd finally be on the map. We'd all be wealthy. Don't go work at the mine. And you're also probably going to be wealthy. If he wants to, you know, stay in this area, build it up, you're going to have... It's going to be beneficial. Too bad you're all too weak to reach out and take it, and it's mine now. Of course, you could also say, who actually owned it before, you know... Was it really cronyism, or was it stripped from someone, or blah, blah, blah. <coughs> <coughs> Don't worry. I'll be sure to pay you at least a little something to work for me. Well, and he can't exactly pay complete this whole thing of, oh, we pay just minimum wage, and that's all. Um, if that was the case, then everyone would be paying minimum wage everywhere. You know who gets paid minimum wage? People worth minimum wage. I, it's all about... Discounted marginal productivity. You'll afford to feed your children. That's what you want, right? Okay, this is about some Marxist crap. Pseudo-economics. You annoying, no nosy child. You think having a monster makes you untouchable, don't you? I'm a forward thinker. Do you really think a man like me wouldn't be prepared for trouble like you? Why am I facing him? I don't want to... Scavengeist. Scaven. It's a geist. So, scavengeist. Swipe, swipe. What the heck?
What just happened? Did he just switch out? This is Chrissa. Okay. Okay, hold on. All right, say crit. Oh my god. All right, come out, harvest skin. Good. Okay. Who? Anyways, I forgot what that type is called. I'll have to look it up. Harrowing defense twenty percent. Okay. Whatever. Mhm. Mm mhm. Mm uh huh. Thirty-one. I'm not gonna be fast enough, am I? No. I am gonna have to switch them out. So switch. I really don't care about Bylat. Keep Walrus. I'll put out Laz though. Mm -hmm. Spore shot. Ooh. Dang. Not an experience. Awesome. That's good. Yeah, that's good experience. I won't say that. that's because of experience. It's good experience. Okay. Dang you, dang you, punk. Dang all of you. You're all beneath me. Just bottom fears grasping for pennies. You'll never make it without me. You better run, Jasper. You better pray I don't catch you. You think you can own us? You think you can stare our, starve our kids? Guys, you're the one that's wanting to steal the mine from him. He never said you were slaves. He would hire you for a wage. And guess what? If you didn't think it was good enough, you could keep your farming life. You could keep whatever your thing is. If your wages are... If you work for him and you think, man, it's your too low wages, but you keep working for him, maybe it's because it's higher wages and or just higher just profit than what you otherwise, you know. You're making more, buddy. If you're really worried about him paying minimum wage and there's no good alternative, then it tells me you all are stupidly poor and that you are, would be, it would and should be thankful for having that high of a wage comparatively. You think you can, okay. Starve your kids. Well, don't work for him. And of course, what's a mind got to do with anything? And starving kids. Charging stuff? So you think him starving out his clientele is going to be profitable for him? If he could, he wouldn't. But it's a situation so dire that no matter what he does, you know, unless he just pretty much runs himself out of business at a loss, you're going to have your kids starve? Well, he's going to run out of business. Then your kids are screwed. Maybe, about, maybe move. Get a better job. Do something. Instead of... <sighs> Jasper's just trying to help. Well, he help himself. But thanks to capitalism and voluntary exchanges, even the most greedy person, if they if they just operate in the market, not in government, and not in like some mafia, then um, yeah, it's beneficial to everyone. The most greedy, greedy son of gun you can think of is actually helping people by selling, or you know, selling things to them, or uh, hiring them, stuff like that. And if he's being, you know, if he's like, "Oh, I'm gonna car," you want this piece of gum, a hundred bucks, and like today's environment, okay, whatever, he's gonna go lost. You don't have to be talking about how greedy he is. He's hurting himself. Okay. Um, I'm sorry? Dad, wait. Oh, okay. Oh. So the townspeople chase out a man from town. 
He runs. Gets killed. It's like taking away a man's horse in a desert and he dies. That's murder. Yeah, no right to do that. And its consequences led to death. Hey, I recognize you. Oh, yeah. Yep, 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 yep. All right, guys. I'm going to be doing another episode of this immediately afterwards. I'm going to try to get to the do cave thing. Anyways, that's all for this episode. Remember to subscribe to me. If you're already here watching multiple episodes, then I'll have more content out that you'll like as well. Excuse me. And again, if you want to get a game, go to nicksnar.com forward slash humble bundle so you can help charity and support the channel as well as get a game. That's all for this video, so I'll see you in the next one. Retro on.